No, we good. We're All good. I have to do is hit start recording. Okay. So. Looks like we got Justice and Choi versus Van and Blink. All right. Red Team, otherwise known as Blue Dynamite, <laughs> went to Gwinnett Brawl a couple months ago. They did oh, yeah? fairly well. They knocked okay. me and uh, Marcus out in the losers. Well, that's not hard. I'm, it's not, no. <laughs> oh, and oh, that the double me. E. All right, so. So, I really like Justice's Captain Falcon. He's not quite Fatality, but who is? Yeah, that, yeah that's a good point. I mean, you yeah. can't really see Captain, or, uh, see Fatality, but we got some pretty interesting characters going on right here. Villager and uh, Greninja. We don't get to see much Greninja here. Ooh, and the spike on the Greninja player. Alright, so Cloud whips the uh, side B there, but it's fine. He'll get his limit back eventually. Yeah. So, uh, it doesn't look like it's been an issue just yet, oh but normally goodness. Clouds join the blue team. Yeah. 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 Uh, isn't it tournament regulation that you're supposed to be blue team if you're going to play Cloud? Uh, not so much for Cloud, because Cloud's a newer thing. But if you're blue team, you're supposed to be the blue color, and red yeah. team is the red color. And they did that, so we can't really uh, blame them for the cloud. Yeah, play. I mean, plus if you get confused as to whether or not Cloud's on your team, then you're probably yeah. not supposed to be playing this game. Well, I mean, it's not a big deal when there's only one Cloud on the team, but when there's one on each team, it gets a little bit more yeah, confusing. Yeah, if there were two. Ooh, and the side B connects. Almost killing his teammate. It's all right. I mean, they have stocks to spare. It's five stocks to two with Villager at kill percent. Yeah, this is uh, looking pretty rough for the blue team here. And oh. that back there is going to seal it. So we're in the 2v1 scenario now. Uh, I feel like we're going to see some pretty silly cloud stuff because he's sitting there charging his limit. Yeah, I'm hoping for it, honestly. Yeah. I really want to see a setup for that. Yep. Yeah. Okay, that's what. Oh, Owen we live in though! Nerf boys. Yeah, those nerfs were real off that aerial uh, finishing touch. Yeah, that was uh, that was surprising. Yeah, it looks like he's trying to do it old school now, just do it with the up air. He's like, uh. oh, good shot, Greninja, getting the stock. He's like, hey man, you uh, guys ooh, might win. Spot dodge read. And actually, a uh, grounded finishing touch being a lot stronger than aerial finishing touch. Yes. So much stronger. Way stronger. All right, that was game one. Uh, game two, what do you think the blue team is going to have to do to win? It looks like they think they have to switch up the character pick. Now, you think they're switching to their mains, or are they just trying to counterfeit characters? Um, well, Bayonetta does win uh, both of these matchups, obviously her being Bayo. And Bayo. then I could see Corrin uh, being able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Cloud, so this shouldn't be too bad for them. They just really got to avoid uh, getting spiked off stage by Captain Falcon. Yes. <laughs> well, I mean, they got hit by, like, two or three of them, so... Yeah. Got to at least make them earn it a little bit harder. All right, I like Battlefield just because it's my stage. I, I don't know about the counterpicks and everything. I feel like the last time I saw a Bayonetta and teams, the platforms were kind of messing with some of the shenanigans. Yeah, I'm not sure about picking Battlefield, honestly. Uh, you would think that with Bayo being on the on the team now that they would go to a flip more flat stage, but I, I don't know, maybe. Yeah. Well, I mean, at the else. same time, Bayonetta makes zero to death super easy on the platforms. Yeah. I've experienced that <laughs> firsthand. That's true, but you got to be above them to do it, so it's okay. I mean, Corrin benefits pretty well from platforms, so I can see this going well, but so does Captain Falcon. So. You know, I was going to say Blue Team is doing better this time. They had the stock lead, or not the stock lead, the percent lead, and then Corrin's just like, hey, I'm going to down air and kill myself. <laughs> Amen. And then he comes back almost immediately and kills Captain Falcon. He's like, oh, I didn't need that stock anyway. We'll keep things even like this. Now... You've played Bayonetta in teams. How easy is it to Bayonetta in teams? Um, so, it's relatively easy. I mean, obviously the teammate can interrupt the combo, uh, but as long as your teammate is dedicated to uh, keeping the other person busy while you're doing the combo, then it's it's fine. It's arguably easier to like start the combo just because of all the craziness going yeah. on. Yeah. 
Now, I haven't seen a ton of Bayonetta combos right now. It feels like, oh, and you missed that attack? Oh, we got your jump. Uh, oh, we he, missed that the yeah, recovery, though. Yeah, messed up the recovery pretty bad. You hate to see that happen. Or Except, you like to see it, whichever yeah, you prefer. Yeah, whichever and, side of the Bayo debate you're on. Most people hate or love to see it happen. Yeah, and Korn got spiked by that Falcon. It was kind of pretty. Like I said at the beginning of the match, <laughs> you got to avoid getting spiked off stage. Oh. oh! We making it back, though. And he really needs to be careful. He's expending his double jump before he's using his up B, and that really limits the recovery. And I thought Bayo was going to die there, but living a little bit longer, this is Battlefield. Yeah. Well, I mean, the top is not as big as the other bla blast zones. Yeah. But that is a Rage Cloud. That is a very scary yeah, cloud. Yeah, they need to get rid of him immediately. Honestly, the kill throw for Corrin would definitely seal the stock, so just yeah. like grab on him. But this is Steams, and Justice is pretty on point about trying to smother the Corrin. The team up air juggles. Alright, so let's see what we're going to uh, see here. Okay, that was cute. I that was that. very cute. Covering... Uh, all the options there on the platform to roll. That always oh. throws me off when Captain Falcon just runs up and drops off the edge with you. Yeah, I th he's like the only character that does that too, isn't he? Yeah, I think it's just because he keeps all his momentum when he runs. So. Yeah. I've all seen right. some very interesting kills from Griffin because of something like that. Alright, we got the daps for the good games. 